I saw Sam Harris say something profoundly stupid. So according to Sam Harris's reasoning, the moral superiority of Israel over Hamas can be summed in the following argument. For Israel, human shields are a deterrent toward attacking Palestinians, meaning Hamas has to hide behind civilians to deter Israel, whereas Hamas uses human shields. He said, consider the moral difference between using human shields and being deterred by them. What a profoundly stupid fucking thing to say. They're not sending their best, these ac academias and universities. Now, what's the major flaw in Sam Harris's argument? Has it ever occurred to Sam Harris, the idiot, that moral high ground is only possible from a position of power? Hamas would also be deterred from striking civilians if they were accountable to the international community because of the power they wield. But they're not accountable accountable to the international community because they don't wield any power. They are not part of any internationally recognized state that is beholden to the UN and so on and so forth. Hamas is in Gaza. Hamas is the one who has everything to gain and Israel's the one who has everything to lose. So of course Israel can posture that it has a moral high ground because it's not immediately engaging in the full scale annihilation of every single person in Gaza. But consider the following fact, and I'm not just making an appeal to emotion. What difference really does it make to the countless mothers mourning over their children being bombed to smithereens by Israeli missiles? Oh, you didn't kill all of us. Oh, you were slightly deterred by Hamas's quote-unquote use of human shields. That didn't stop Netanyahu from killing thousands of civilians in Gaza, perhaps tens of thousands. So I'm not sure what the actual merit in this argument is supposed to be. Sam Harris is a fucking idiot. This assumes that Hamas and Israel are in a position of equal power, but they're not. So this is just a stupid argument.